This video will walk you through the setup and assembly of a USA-made Detecto IBFL 500 in-bed scale. Begin by removing the column assembly from the box with the help of an assistant and setting it aside. Next, remove the base assembly and then open the inner box that has the remaining parts and indicator, setting each of them just outside of your workspace until they are needed. Take care to keep the boom assembly packed and strapped until it comes time to attach it. Finally, remove the support hoops at the bottom of the box and set them aside. The assembly process begins with the base and moves up along the scale. Start with the base, which must be turned upside down in order to expose the bottom bolt that secures the column to the base. Remove the bolt and then turn the base upright and remove the top bolt. Before attaching the column, be sure to set the brakes on the wheel to avoid any undesirable movement of the base. Once locked into place, simply slide the column into the bracket on the base, install and tighten the top bolt. With assistance once more, turn the base onto its side to install and tighten the bottom bolt. Next, we'll add the stretcher cup to the base, which is designed to help secure the stretcher during transportation and storage. Remove the small bolt from the base, align the center hole in the stretcher cup with the hole on the mounting bracket and replace the bolt. Now, we will attach the boom assembly to the top of the column assembly. First, remove the bolt so that the boom assembly may be attached between the mounting plates of the column assembly. With assistance, insert the boom assembly between the mounting plates of the column assembly and replace the bolt. Then remove the small bolt from the underside of the boom assembly that is holding the load cell cable in place. This is the cylinder mounting plate where you will connect the hydraulic cylinder to the boom assembly, secured by the same bolt. Note the location of the bolt in the cylinder mounting plate as it must be reinstalled into the same hole. Place the other end of the cylinder into the ball socket located on the column assembly and hand tighten to secure the cylinder in place. Be sure to have the help of someone else as the ball socket is delicate and the boom assembly is heavy. Next, remove the four bolts on either side of the column assembly and attach the push handles, replacing the bolts and securing the handles into place. The boom assembly can now be fully unwrapped. Take care when cutting away the packing and straps that have secured the load cell tube into place. This part of the scale is where the load cells are located and is the most delicate piece of the scale. Remove the outer bolts from the hoop retainer plates located on opposite sides of the load cell tube and loosen the inner bolt so that you can rotate the plate 90 degrees. This is designed to securely fasten the support hoops to the load cell tube. You should apply a small amount of the included Loctite on the bolt for secure fit. Attach the support hoops and rotate the plate back into place and replace the outer bolts. To attach the 750 indicator, simply run the load cell cable around the column and through the bracket. Plug it into the back of the indicator and tighten the cable connecting the screws. Then slide the indicator into place on the mounting bracket until it locks in place. For transport and storage, it is important to attach the red anti-swing bars to the support hoops. They aid in keeping the support hoops from swinging about and keep the scale more stable during movement. Secure the stretcher support hoops to the column by attaching the rear anti-swing bar using the attached Velcro strap. After removing the bed sling from the box, simply insert one end into the stretcher cup at the base of the column and secure the stretcher by using the two Velcro straps located along the column assembly. For operation, the red anti-swing bars should be removed and the stretcher attached to the support hoops by inserting the hooked ends through the four holes in the stretcher support bars. Remember to always set the wheel brakes when operating the IBFL 500 in-bed scale. For more information about Detecto in-bed scales, please contact us at 1-800-641-2008 or visit us online at www.detecto.com, your one-stop shop for all of your healthcare weighing needs. Detecto offers more than 110 years of experience in medical-grade accuracy.